what is your interpretation of what's going on there with Fox and Tucker? I mean, I don't know. Just just from what I've seen of the reports, uh, there's a couple different theories. Rupert Murdoch was threatened personally by Tucker because his fiance was saying he was a prophet, and then the the wedding broke off, and then Tucker gets fired. There's a the fiance said Tucker is a prophet. That was one of the news reports that came out. <laughs> that apparently they had a dinner. <laughs> then Rupert Murdoch's you know fiance is saying like, oh he's a he's a prophet, he's a genius. Oh God. And a month later he's like, you're out of my company. <laughs> yeah, I'm the prophet. Yeah, yeah. I, I think from a business perspective, if you own a brand. And then you hire a personality, and the personality is becoming bigger than the brand. Any CEO is going to get rid of that that person. It's a threat to their brand. That's that's it. You I, think so? Yeah. Uh, I, I don't I, know about that. I, I don't think know, Murdoch, I don't know any. Murdoch. Uh, my view would be that Murdoch is saying Fox News is the company. If we're at a point where people are saying Fox News is doomed because of one man, that man should not be at this company, even if it means it hurts us in the short term. In the long term, Fox News needs to stand on its own. Yeah, yeah you, you have a point there. And the reason why I say I don't think any, because I think Kraft, Robert Kraft of the New England Patriots, for every, you know, one person that knows Robert Kraft, a thousand people know Tom Brady. And, and he was very comfortable with Tom being the, uh, the show. Or Belichick, he kept those guys. And Jerry Buss, if you think about Jerry Buss, Jerry Buss was a playboy, you know, but you know, in LA, he was always at the clubs with the girls and all this stuff. He was a guy you wanted to party with. He was a big real estate guy. In 33 years of owning the Lakers, they won 10 championships. Wow. And he had the Magic bigger than Jerry Buss, Kobe bigger than Jerry Buss, Shaq bigger than Jerry Buss, Pat Riley bigger than Jerry Buss. I think there are some that can do it. Obviously, at this phase, I don't know the in, in, internal side of the story here, but to have a girl that you're dating. <laughs> for her to come. You Man, he's a go. prophet, it's dude. It's a wrap. It's done. He's also yeah, 92 years old, so it's... But is it messenger from God? Yeah. <laughs> you know what Rupert said? I am God. Yeah. <laughs> if he's a messenger, I am yeah. God, right? Anyways, so, you know, we're going to see what's going to happen there with... Uh, but some of these Republicans or conservative, as much as they bitch about what's going on, and look what Soros is doing. Do you see how dark Soros is? Look at all these media. Uh, stop. Either buy him or be quiet and stop bitching about it. He's going to keep buying them up. You have money as well. So you're just using your money to buy real estate and other bullshit. You can also pick up some media to control your own narrative and competing. And you, all you do is 24-7. Yeah, but look what Soros is doing. Look what this guy's doing. We're putting our money on the line. Some companies are putting their money on the line saying, let's go play ball. Other companies are sitting there saying, look how dark he is. Put up some money. You have money. You know what Musk did? Musk took $44 billion and bought Twitter at the worst possible time. <laughs> at the yeah. worst possible time. And what did he call it? I'm running a freaking nonprofit yep. organization. Yep. So if you like this clip and you want to watch another one, click right here. And if you want to watch the entire podcast, click right here.